Hey everybody, thanks for tuning in. It is March the 9th, I believe, 9th or 10th. And I'm gonna do my first hive inspection. It's in the mid 60s right now, so I'm hoping to get into my hives and my goal is to, my goal or my hope is to find laying uh, some brood in this, this and this hive. These two hive, that hive on the far end and that hive on that end, they're both, they're both dead out. So these two, I got more hope than this one. I, I think this one's pretty weak right now. So I'm gonna do a quick inspection here and hopefully I'll have some cool stuff to show you. Be bringing in some pollen from somewhere. Right here, that bee right there has pollen all over its legs. So does that one. They're at least bringing some pollen in. See that bee right there with all the pollen? Lots of pollen on its legs. There's a few, few of them out there up for, foraging, foresting. Oh, I see eggs down here. There's fresh eggs all over in these in these cones. Awesome. The queen could be on here. There's fresh eggs everywhere on that one. More pollen, early pollen, that's cool. There's fresh eggs all over in here. This frame has fresh eggs all over it. No cat brood, but there's fresh eggs everywhere. That's cool, very, very cool. This hive's gonna be building up quickly, I know it. I have the feeling the queen's on this frame somewhere, but I just can't spot her right now. Oh, there's the queen right here. No wonder I couldn't find her on the other one. Right in front of my hive tool. She's down underneath, right. Right there, and that's right there she is. Awesome. And she's in there laying eggs, so that's a good sign. Close this one up for now. And then I'm going to be checking out these other ones. I'll turn you back on if something else cool shows up. Okay, so my second hive, it actually has cat brood in it. And like the third frame I pulled out, I found the queen already. She's right there at the end of my hive tool, cruising up there. This is all cat brood already, early in the March. So this is really cool, really, really cool for this hive. Queen looking good. She's really long. They're bringing in pollen. And they already got cat brood in early March. Definitely be making some splits soon. Won't take long. He's doing good. I'd like to clean off some of these frames, but I don't want to disturb her too much. All right, so hopefully if this one still has a queen, hopefully she's starting to lay. I mean, it won't take them long, but this one, the last time I was ever in this hive, it was very, very small pack of bees in here. So this one's starting to go. I'm gonna steal another box. I already stole, I stole one box off of here, stuck on top of here, that was almost solid honey. So now the queen's laying in this box. They're gonna have enough honey to get going really, really fast. So I've got two hives that are getting ready to kick it. So we're gonna check out the third one. There's literally just a tiny, maybe a few hundred bees in here. But I have some hope for this hive yet. As long as they can get some stuff going. Because like there's a little pack on this one here. And literally just a couple hundred bees. I'm going to show you something.
There's a little cluster right here of cat brood already. See, there's just a few bees on there. I got. A lot, I'm hoping this hive, and there's a little pack of cat brood on this one as well. Now it shouldn't be hard to find the queen. There's only a couple hundred bees here. But as soon as my two stronger hives start laying really well, I'll steal some frames of cat brood and shove over here. Help this one build up. Oh well, I've got two strong hives that are ready to take off. I think they're gonna take off quickly. And one weak hive. And I still have two hives at another apiary. It'll be time to make splits pretty soon. All right, thanks everybody for tuning in. And this is my first beehive inspection of 2020. I appreciate everybody watching.